I'm going to do general finishes, gray gel stain. But before that, I prefer to use Minwax pre-stain. A lot of people use mineral spirits. I prefer this. I think it gets a better... I prefer it. I get better results. I wipe. I put it on nice and heavy. Let it absorb. This is a custom job. We'll sand it down with 150. I don't like to strip anything. If I can sand it, I'll sand it. I'm going to do the whole thing right now. The general finish is gel stain. I, I use Java the most. It's what I sell the most. This is a custom job. They want it gray. So, gray it is. I don't use, do a whole lot of gray. Java is what I like to do the most. And we're going to put armor seal on this. We'll post a video of the armor seal probably tomorrow. But for now, the stain. The instructions say let it sit for 10 minutes. But I noticed that if it's wet, a little bit wet, your, your stain just glides a little bit more. This is one of those tables made in Malaysia. I have no idea what kind of wood it is. I know it sucks up fast. Just even it out. General Finishes has a lot of videos out there. I just, this is the way I prefer to do it. Their way is wonderful too. Everybody has their own way of working, their own techniques. I just love their stain. I'm out of shop towels because my order hasn't come in yet. So I'm using rags. Shop towels make it a whole lot easier. I think it's faster too. On a table like this, I'll work in sections. it in kind of like pushing it into the grain a little bit I don't let it dry if you let it dry then you have a hard time getting it off you just wipe it off one clean stroke from one end to the other that's all you need Get that done. Carefully get your edge, not to hit the top. The edges suck up more because of the, the wood grain. It's all edge grain. table like this I like to keep the table together that way I look and see make sure it's looking even that I didn't miss any spots and when I wipe it off that it looks even 
some woods you might have to put two coats. Just work it in. Push it into that grain. Once your rag or your towel gets too saturated, just flip it over. You get all your rag marks out. That's why I prefer shop towels. But they were supposed to arrive yesterday. And this goes a long way. I've had this cork for, I've only done a couple of projects with it, but I buy the Java by the gallon. When I buy the gallon, I buy the cork cans at Home Depot or Lowe's or local hardware store. And I put it in cork cans and just open one quart at a time. A gallon will last me a long time. And that's all I use is Java. I do about seven or eight of these tabletops a month and I build my own cabinets. Find a product that's good, you stick with it. And that's general finish. Now, some of you have been doing this longer than I have. and probably have better techniques. This is just the way I've been doing it. And it works for me so far, so hopefully it works for somebody else. Once you get done, go over some spots that you might have missed or wiped a little bit too soon or too hard. But sanding is the, is the trick. Sand with 150 random orbital sander, and then 150 by hand. Make sure you don't get any of the little rings from your orbital sander. It looks pretty even from here. We'll see when it dries tomorrow. It's a little humid here in Indiana right now, so might have to wait a couple of days. But once it dries, we'll see what it looks like, and if it needs another coat, we'll give it another coat. If not, we'll do the armor seal, and good to go.
Hope you enjoy. Thank you.